find us, Jose Monkey. You asked me to figure out where this video was recorded, so I did. Hi, I'm Jose Monkey, and I find people who ask to be found. This is a good one, guys. I think the person that recorded the video said it best when they said, You can find us. This would be impressive. No gas stations, no stores, no signs. There's a few clues around. It's true, there are a few clues here, and one of them is probably closer to you than you think. So what can we see? As the video opens, we can see that there is a body of water behind this person and their dog. We can also see this white water tower off in the distance. As they turn the camera, we can see that there's what looks like a path going around the body of water. I thought that that meant that this was maybe like a park or a trail or something like that. We can see what looks like a porta potty across the way here, but I didn't think that'd be too much help. Next, we get a view in the other direction, and it's really just trees and grass. As they come back around, we see the water once again, and we can see a structure that looks sort of like a dam or spillway here. Then they complete the 360 degree turn and, just for good measure, decide to spin around one more time. And guys, if that was all that there was to see here, I would have been very pessimistic about finding this place. But we've got one more clue. I've mentioned before that clothing and accessories that you wear can often be an unexpected source of information. They can sometimes reveal things, including clues about the location where the video was recorded. And while this person isn't wearing anything too revealing, our furry friend here is. This dog is wearing a rabies tag, which gives us a bit of information. For much of the video, the tag is not really visible, but there are a handful of frames where we can make out some of the writing. Toward the end of the video, I was able to see a few frames where we can make out a phone number. It appears to start in 407 and end in 2000 or 2800 or something like that. We can also see what appears to say IL here, which I assumed was an abbreviation for Illinois. So I used that information and what I could make out of the partial phone number to do some searching, and I quickly discovered that that phone number is associated with the DuPage County Animal Services in Illinois. Okay, so I figured that meant DuPage County might be a good place to start. Of course, that's kind of a large area. According to Wikipedia, DuPage County is about 336 square miles or 870 square kilometers. But I was feeling pretty encouraged that I'd gotten that far, so I just started looking around. Look for what, trees? Well, like I said, I thought that we had what looked like a dam or a spillway here. So I started Googling for anything like that in DuPage County. Unfortunately, I didn't find anything useful right away. I thought maybe that water tower would help, so I started looking for where there are water towers in that county. But there were a whole bunch of them, and it looks like this tower is at least a mile away from this location, so I wasn't sure how much help it would be. Then I had another idea. Like I said, I got the sense that maybe the path that we see here was part of a trail. So I started looking around for trails in that area. I figured I could look for one that had a large body of water like what we see in the video. So I switched to the satellite view, and it didn't take me long to find this place that looked promising. We had a path around a body of water, and when I looked on the west side, it looked like we might have something that might be that spillway that we saw in the video. So I went to get a closer look. And guys, that was it. You are here, near Maple Lake, on the North Central DuPage Regional Trail, in Roselle, Illinois. I wasn't sure at first how to confirm that this was the correct location, but then, as luck would have it, I found a user-submitted 360-degree photo on Google Maps, and it was taken from almost the exact spot where this video was recorded. That helped me to confirm this view that we see from the video, and also a view to the northwest where we can see that spillway or whatever that was. Once I found this place, I went off on a bit of a side quest to see if I could find that water tower, and I'm pretty sure it's this one that's just about a mile away, but the funny thing is it says Roselle right on the water tower. Obviously, that writing isn't visible in the video, or else this would have been really easy to find. Okay, it's time to check which previous location is closest to this one. And this time it was in Season 1, Episode 182, in West Chicago, Illinois. That spot's only about 8 miles or 13 kilometers away from this place. If anybody else wants me to find them, record a video where you say, Find me, Jose Monkey, on camera, or hold up a sign that says something similar. And don't forget to tag me in a comment on that video.